Hi there survivors, it's the Immortal Adrian here, welcome to Ark Survival Evolved, this is episode 31 and in this episode we're going to be talking about building a greenhouse around our crops so we can get a better result from the crops. Now what we need for a greenhouse is the greenhouse walls and ceiling, so let's just check our engrams. And uh, I think I might already have them. We'll just put in green. Yes, I've already taken the greenhouse wall, ceiling, triangle ceiling, greenhouse door, frame, and greenhouse door. And what we need for that is crystal and cementing paste. Now, as we've done in a previous episode, we make cementing paste using keratin or chitin and stone. Now I've got some cementing paste in here but I got that earlier and I'm going to show you where I got that. So firstly let's let's make what we can cementing paste we can craft 14 so that's going to use the keratin and the chitin. Keratin we get from horned animals like um, Carnotaurus and the chitin we get from insects and keratin we also get from turtles. Now cementing paste we're only going to get like 17 from here. I'll show you a place where we can get a lot of cementing paste and I'm going to take one of these raptors with me. I'm going to take the strongest one Buster and down the beach a little bit down this other creek so I'm going to head down the western side, down the western beach and down the creek that's on the western side of our base. Now this is down the side that our original base was on across the river there. So we're not going to cross the river, we're just going to go down this beach and then turn right and head down this river. Now there's a creature down here called a giant beaver and they create things called beaver dams and in these beaver dams they produce cementing paste. Now my raptor's just gotten a little bit tired here so I'll just rest him up and keep going. Now there's a couple of things to know about these giant beaver dams is they will, if you destroy the beaver dam they will come and rebuild it. If you don't destroy the beaver dam, then they will just ignore it. So if you're going to take the cementing paste from the beaver dam, you have to destroy it. But don't kill the beavers. Now, let's just have a look around here. There's probably going to be some um, piranhas. Yes, here they are. Now, the best way to deal with these piranhas, I think at this stage, is probably going to be... Okay, the reason I did that is because I didn't want to take any damage. Heal, heal. Let's yeah, have another look around. Any more of those guys? Now, down here there is a giant beaver dam. Here he comes. Okay, that should be it for piranhas, hopefully. We've taken a bit of damage there. Didn't really want to take any damage, but such is the game. So, where were we? Underwater. No more piranha. Okay, in front of us here, there's what looks like a pile of sticks. And this pile of sticks looking thing here, this is the giant beaver dam. And as we get closer, you will see that it actually tells us 
that it's a giant beaver dam. Now, as soon as I hit the E key to check its its inventory, the giant beavers are going to come for me, usually. Now, in this case, I'm pretty sure the giant beavers have been killed because when I came down here earlier, I saw the giant beaver getting attacked by a crocodile. So I think they've been killed. Now, you have to be careful if you come down here and there are giant beavers around, you have to use a different technique. You have to lure them away and then come and get the stuff. So I'll show you what's going on here. Now that they're not around, we can open the beaver dam. And here's our cementing paste. We'll take that. But actually, we want to pretty much take everything and then dump out the wood, take the last of that, and that will destroy the beaver dam. And that's important, as I mentioned before. Now, the beavers will come back and they will rebuild that beaver dam. Now, if there's no beavers around now, they will respawn. They will eventually respawn and come back. I think that's a dead piranha in front of us there. Yes, it is. So, let's have a look at our inventory. And yes, we got... 146 cementing paste and some rare mushrooms and some rare flowers. So remember, if you do happen to run into a, a giant beaver, don't kill him. What you do is you jump off, you hit the E key to open the inventory and then run away really quickly and the beaver will chase you. And just run up the beach here, quite a distance because they're very slow and you have to wait a little bit, let them catch up to you. And then when they've caught up, turn around and run back. And then you'll have enough time to get into the beaver dam, take what you need and come out. And then come back later and rip all the rest of the wood out. And you have to remember to rip all the rest of the wood out so that they rebuild the dam. So I'll just cut the video here, pick it back up again when I get back to the base. Okay, so here we are back at the base. Now let's just go inside and see what we've managed. We got 146 cementing paste. Now in the greenhouse, under the greenhouse folder, there's just the triangle ceiling, weirdly enough. But under structures, you'll find another folder called greenhouse. And in here is your greenhouse walls and your ceiling greenhouse door etc now it costs 35 crystal to make a ceiling panel we've only got 95 crystal so I'm going to build one ceiling panel and one wall panel and that's all I can afford at this stage I need nine more crystal to finish what I'm doing and I don't have any more so let's just work with what we've got just before it gets too dark it looks like it might be getting dark and I'm going to put one of the greenhouse walls right there and before I do anything else let's look here Markaberry seed fruit lean greenhouse effect zero now I'm going to put a greenhouse ceiling there and now greenhouse effect 30 percent problem is it's very hard to walk around so we have to crouch down when we get under here so all of these ones are giving us a greenhouse effect of 30 percent so that's better than nothing that will improve the greenhouse a little bit so we have to find more crystal We've probably got enough cementing paste to do what we need, but we need to find some more crystal. So I'm going to end that episode there, and in the next episode we're going to, I don't know, maybe look for some more crystal somewhere. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Uh, put in your likes and please uh, send me a comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so, and keep your eye out for my new um, series, which is base building and construction, where you can get a whole heap of tips and tricks for building really nice looking bases and buildings. Okay, we'll see you next time. Take care.